Welcome back to my channel. I'm going to be restoring this old blower. It, used, it was made to um, blow all the hot air out of the garage and blow it out. And it used to go up here, up on top, my vent, and it would blow out all the warm air out of the garage. And I'm going to restore it and we'll just do a little walk around on it. I'm going to be starting to take the motor off and the belt. That way um, it won't get damaged when I power wash it. So I'm gonna put it up on the cart and start taking it apart. see all this pitted rust surface rust I'm gonna use this uh, osphosis and um, I'm gonna get this kill all this rust on this and then I'll be able to paint it I got this soak in here I got it pretty on um, pretty heavy um, and this, this stuff will just, it neutralizes um, the rust and it just kind of kills it, stops it from rusting. And then I'll probably put a, a couple more spritz on it through the day and then I'll leave it sit for like 24 hours and let it really soak in and eat all it and kill all that rust. So I'm done with this. Um, I took this motor all apart and um, I cleaned it. It was all full of uh, mud daubers and this whole thing was just cake full of hornet goo and garbage and stuff. And I blew it all the way out and cleaned it. it was all this, this garbage was inside that motor. So when I had it all apart, I. I checked the bearings, made sure everything was nice and clean, and um, now I'm putting it back together.
this is the next day. I put that uh, rust kill stuff on, and um, all the rust got um, sealed, and that chemical eats the rust, and then it turns kind of like black. So it says you just let it dry after 24 hours, and you can paint right over it. So I just scotch sprayed it a little bit, and now I'm going to paint it. Finished up painting everything. I put a new cord on this motor. Um, I cleaned it all up. It's running good. And I painted this squirrel cage blower. And then I painted uh, the pulley. And I cleaned the cleaned the shaft up on the lathe and bought new bearings. And then um, I painted the squirrel cage holder and um, now I'm going to get ready to uh, assemble it. We're ready to um, assemble whoa, this. Whoa, 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 Dad. The clear on your head's killing the view. <laughs> what? How's this? That better? Better. <laughs> How's it look? Good. All right, all right. Okay, we're going to start assembling this um, this uh, blower assembly, and um, it's going to come out good when we're done. Um, I just got done getting this uh, blower all the way back together. Um, it pulls like eight amps. So, and if I would have went to 220 on it, it would only pull four amps. But I got it wired for uh, 110. <clears throat> I had to put new bearings in it. And, um, paint and uh, I recycled the old belt I put a different pulley on it um, so very good it's probably gonna hold up a lot better now so thank you for watching and this to redo this was like um, $80 <laughs>